Hello! Professor again. I'm Jay Force. And we are back for more Keep Talking and Nobody Explodes. And nobody exploded last time. Uh, nope. All the sure lie. Nope. There. No, no. That never happened. <laughs> You're here now. Nobody exploded. And it is time to try some more. And this time, J Force has the instructions, oh dear. and I have the bomb, and I'm certain I will not explode at all. Let's hope so. So, we are at, we are continuing where we left off, and we are at pick up the pace, which is uh, number four in section two. It has, we have three minutes, three modules, and strikes. Reading this only uses up time you don't have, which is a lie because the bomb hasn't started yet. Top chop. So let's start. So let's see how it goes this time. So here we go. We have a, a keypads, a lab uh, maze, and memory. Okay. Let's take the keypad first. Okay. So we have the dumbbell thing. Do you know what a dumbbell is? Yeah. The weightlifting thing. Mm -hmm. Uh, there is a um, backwards E with the two dots. Where is it? Yes, I see. Oh, okay. And there is um, a backwards N with uh, some arms hovering above it. Okay. And then a horseshoe thing. I think it's an omega. Simple. Hmm. Might be. It looks like an O oh, with yeah. that's open at the bottom and it has two feet. So which one do I press first? Okay. So <laughs> could you tell me the symbols again? The dumbbell. The, oh. the omega symbol, backwards E with two dots, and the backwards N with the arms above it. So... You... There are more symbols in the column. Ignore those, and just tell me the order of the symbols from top to bottom. Okay. Backwards That's E. Correct. We now have one minute remaining. And we have spent it all on one module. God damn it. Uh, I'm already lost. So it's either the dumbbell, the omega symbol, or the end. That's next. It will be somewhere below. Which comes first below the E? Try the dumbbell. Correct. Oh dear. Twenty seconds left. Um, I don't think we're gonna make it. Backwards C. That's not a thing. Oh, damn it! It's either the N or the Omega symbol. Oh shit. M. M. Correct. Omega. And Omega. Oh. And boom. Oh, Finished please. one module in. Three minutes, and I'm now dead, splattered across the office. Oh dear, this is gonna be great. But now we got one module figured out. Right, learning. Yeah, well, it's it's your first time doing the reading thing. It can be difficult. Retry. 
Especially when you don't know the symbols immediately. Mm -hmm. Right, so let's go again. I see uh, there is wires, a maze, and memory. Let's take the memory first. The screen says one. It's more difficult than you think at first decrypting the instructions because you have you're not entirely sure what the order you need to read them in is. Wait, what does the display say? One. If the display is one, press the button in the second position. Okay, so three on one. The display now says one. Okay. The display is one, press the button labeled four. Okay, so that's four on four. The button the display now says one. Display says one press a button with the same label you pressed in stage two. Which was four. Correct. The display now says three. Uh, stage three. Three. Press the button in the third position. It's a three. That was incorrect. Now, we now have one strike. I don't think that matters for this. Display? This Four. Press the button in the same position as you pressed the stage. Two. It's four. Correct. What's number? One. I think the module started over. Same label as you pressed in stage one. It's Cor incorrect. Oh. We've, we've lost. There's 20 seconds left. <sighs> I think the bomb is going to explode. No. Or yes, I mean. Can I turn it? And boom. Let's try this again. We try. Alright, we now have memory, wires, and maze again. Let's try the memory again. The display says 3. Uh, okay, 3. Button in the third position. That's a 4 on 3. The display now says 2. Same position as the present stage 1. So, 3. That was a 2 on 3. The display now says 2. Okay. Same label you pressed in stage 1. So 2. Right? Uh, the first number. In sta stage 2. Stage 1. That just said stage 2. No. What was the number in stage 1 then? Uh, Correct. That was a 4 on 2. The display now says 1. Uh, same position as present stage 1. Which was? 4. Wrong. Incorrect. What's the number now? Four. Yeah. Yeah. We now have two strikes. S same 
position that's in stage two is two. Oh. God damn it. Do you know what I mean when I say four on three, for example? That's the button that says four on position three. Uh -huh. okay. So, did you have that backwards? Maybe. Right, let's try again. See if we don't get the memory module this time. And we have wires, Simon Says, and memory, of course. Let's try Simon Says. So first we need to check... How do you rotate the bomb? Hold right click. Ah, okay. Um, so the serial number is VKWTT. So no vowels. And we have a blinking green. Blinking green. Press green. Correct. Now it blinks green yellow. So I'm going to press the same button again and then a second one. The second one is going to be based on the yellow color. Oh, it's a green blue. Wrong. Blue was incorrect. We now have one strike. It's blinking green yellow. Green. Oh, green, green. Incorrect. What? I pressed green once and it was incorrect. Did you forget to look in the row for one strike? We now have two strikes. Okay. It's blinking green, yellow. It's blue, red. That's incorrect. This, or wait, no, blue, red. No, that was correct. Okay. I forgot to, the, the chain because of the strikes. Um, it's now green, yellow, blue. So, blue, red, green. Correct. Green, yellow, blue, blue. So, blue, red, green. Done. Yeah, we have eight seconds remaining. <laughs> I don't think we're going to defuse this. Boom. Well, that's um, also a difficult three. one. <sighs> Is that a five or six? Is it seven? Let's try again. So we have a Simon Says, a button, and a maze. That's it. Let's try the Simon Says again. Yeah. So it's blinking yellow. Does your serial number have any vowels or...? Uh, I'm terrible at that. The serial number is I-G-G-M-U. So it has vowels. The I is a vowels. Yeah. Which I'm one not. is special? Yellow. Uh, green. Correct. Mm -hmm. Yellow, green. Green, yellow. Yellow, green, blue. Uh, green, yellow, red. Done. We have a right. blue button that says abort. Just read through the list. Of instructions. The blue and the button says support, hold the button and refer to the release of the button. Right, I'm holding it. There's a yellow strip. At least when the countdown timer has a 5 in any position. Oh, I just missed it. Uh. Done. 
Getting somewhere. Correct. Now there is a maze. So, can you tell me the positions of the two green circles? Right. So, from the top left, mm -hmm. the circles are in the fourth row, both of them. Fourth. And okay. one is in column four, and one is in the in column six, the last column. Okay. I know which one that is. The white dot is just beneath the leftmost circle at the bottom. Okay. And the red triangle is um, two above the rightmost circle. So, up to. I'm now at the leftmost circle. Uh, just above it. Right. No, I'm in it. Okay, up one. Right. Down to the bottom. Right. Yes. And up. Done. We are done. 19 seconds left. <laughs> nice. Uh, Your first diffused bomb. Yay! The first as the instructor, anyways. Hmm? The first diffused bomb as the instructor. Yeah. Obviously. Right. Now we're moving on to section three. Oh dear. Moderate. Uh, three one. A hidden message. Information can be obscured in ways that are time consuming to decode. In the world of bomb diffusing, that's a bad thing. I wonder why. <laughs> we now have five minutes for three modules and three strikes. So we're the difficulty has gone down a bit. Although I assume there will be other modules now, perhaps some new ones. Yeah. So let's start. Are you ready? Yes. Well, it would be too bad if you're not, because we're starting. So we have wires. Um, who's the who's on who or who's on first that one and the frequency thing yeah radio something oh, yeah. Oh, there. Oh, there. so which one first uh, uh, the morse code it's morse code thing. yeah Oh dear, now we gotta have do Morse code. Yep. Oh. So do you want to do that one first? Yeah, sure, why not? Okay, so you'll have to write down the pattern. Um, so, sh long, short, short. Hmm. Short, short, short. Short, long. Uh, that's really hard to keep up with it. I'm not sure where it loops either. There's a loop. So short, 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 long. I lost it again. Uh, this is really difficult. You're not starting over each time I do that, right? Uh -huh. Because after the, I have a long pause, that's pretty much where the pattern starts over. Because I lose lose track and I just wait for it to 
Yeah. Loop again. So from the start, it's. Uh, I don't think we're gonna make it. Let's do. Let's try the wires. So there are six wires. Six wires. Yes. There are no yellow wires. Yep. Okay. Otherwise, there is exactly one yep. yellow wire. There are no yellow wires. Okay. Otherwise, there are no red wires. Got the last wire. There is a red wire. Otherwise, got the fourth wire. That's this one. Correct. Yay. It's done. Let's try the Husang first. The display says read, as in the plant. Oh, so two E's. Yes. There. So, bottom left. Sure. You are two words. Nope. Done. Nope. Like. Nope. Your apostrophe. Nope. You as in word. Nope. Hold. Yes. Correct. Yes. Display now says your with an apostrophe. Middle right. Your without an apostrophe. U H U H. Nope. U R T H. Uh, yes. Just correct. Display now says red. Um, middle right. U, the letter. Uh huh. Yes. That was incorrect. The letter, the display now says you are your again with an apostrophe. <laughs> Boom. Time ran out. Let's try that again. Hope we don't get the Morse code one again, because that's a really difficult one. As I suspected, it now introduces more difficult modules. Okay, so we have a password one, a button, and the memory one. So, let's do the memory, since I'm on the page already. Okay, so the display says two. Two. Press the button in second position. That's a three on two. The display now says two. The button in the same position as pressing stage one. So that's three on two again. The display says two. Press the button with the same label you pressed in stage one. So it's three on two again. Oh. It happened to be in the same position. Four. Press the button in the same position as pressing stage two. So it's a two on two. And two. Uh, press the button with the same label you pressed in stage two. So that a three? The first number. What's number two. S stage two. Yeah. Same. So three. Correct, done. Yeah. Right. Okay, so we have a button and the password thing. <laughs> Stupid alarm clock. It's it's a it's a green display with letters on it, uh, five of them, and arrow buttons. Mm -hmm. A 
above and be below each one and a submit button. I think that's the password one. So we're looking for a five letter word that start starts with S P Q B V or E. So I don't see anyone that struck with Q. So could be small. Um, yeah, second has an M. Okay, so I I can so spell out small. So Submit correct. It was small. What? <laughs> now we have two minutes to do the button. Should be plenty of time. It's a blue button. This is hold. Though you can just read through the steps. Uh, buttons blue. No, it's more than one battery. There is. Is it save detonates? No. The button is white. No. More than two batteries. Yes. There is a lit ind indicator with a label 4K. No. Okay. The button is yellow. No. Okay. Red. No. Not a hold the button and try to. There is a blue glowing strip. Countdown timer has a 40 minute position. Alrighty. 58, 7, 6, 5, 4. And we did it with 54 seconds left. Yay! It's going great. <laughs> So, because JForce didn't keep an eye on the timer as he was supposed to, uh, this episode ended up being just over an hour long. So, I'm cutting it short here in uh, editing and going to put up the the remaining bit as a, its own video. Um, so, we will see you then for the conclusion.